Hey guys, don't worry, I'm here to help you to fix this problem with the step by step perfect solution. So let's begin. Click on advanced options, select troubleshoot, then click on advanced options. Now select command prompt. Now type chkdsk space slash f space slash r space c colon and hit enter then we need to wait for some time to complete the process once done move to the next step now we need to type this command c colon and simply press enter now we need to type cd space c colon slash and hit enter to execute now type cd space windows and hit enter to execute the command type cd space system32 and simply hit enter now execute this command type cd space config and simply hit enter then type md space backup and hit enter now type copy space star dot star space backup and simply hit enter to execute the command now type md space backup one and simply hit enter now execute this command carefully type in copy space star dot star space backup one then simply hit enter to execute the command now type cd space regback and simply hit enter execute this command type dir then simply hit enter now type copy space star dot star space dot dot and hit enter then type all and hit enter type in boot rec space slash fix mbr and hit enter to execute the command now type in bootrec space slash fix boot and simply hit enter to execute the command now execute this command cd space c colon slash now type cd space windows slash system32 slash config slash regback and hit enter to execute now type this command bcd edit space slash exports space c colon slash bcd backup then hit enter type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type this md space boot and hit enter type cd space boot and hit enter now type md space bcd and simply hit enter to execute this command type cd space c colon slash and hit enter type attrib c colon slash boot slash bcd dash h dash r dash s and hit enter now type ren space c colon backslash boot backslash bcd space bcd dot old then hit enter type bootrec space slash rebuild bcd and hit enter now type exit and simply hit enter now click on continue it will restart your system so that's it guys your problem is solved and you are good to go